Senior Brooklyn Reynolds has been waiting for the vaccine since the beginning of the pandemic. I first wanted to get the vaccine back last spring semester when everything went online. Um, I was going to be a senior that upcoming fall and I wanted everything to get back to normal as soon as possible. So when the vaccine came out, I signed up, registered for everything I could find. Now, Reynolds is one step closer to getting her vaccine. Lara Anton, a press officer for DSHS, says Texas is ready to vaccinate the new age group. They really wanted to make sure that um, we got the most shots in arms as quickly as possible. And so, you know, they had already gone through all of the groups that were at the highest risk of severe disease and hospitalization. Texas has already vaccinated over 10 million people, but it's a long way to go to vaccinate all Texans. Over at UT, University Health Services is prepping for student appointments. We do ask people to please be patient with us. We are working as fast as we can. Um, even once you get on the list, uh, it could be uh, several more weeks, even a month or two. UHS typically distributes around 11,000 Pfizer vaccines a week. But the vaccine is not the end-all be-all for ending the pandemic. Um, vaccines are one more tool, but we still need to have this multi-layered approach. We need to continue to social distance. We need to wear masks. We need to get vaccinated when we can. Uh, wash our hands. Do all of those things we've been saying all along um, to get us across the finish line. Dr. Hines says the wait may feel long, but encourages people to stay in line here at Gregory Gym where vaccines are being distributed. But if you get in the line, stay in the line, um, you don't want to miss your opportunity. Um, and so uh, just be prepared. Uh, it could be a while, but it's worth it uh, to get that shot. Reynolds says the vaccine cannot come soon enough. I'm excited to get the vaccine because I graduate in a month, little less than a month, and I want my friends and family to be able to gather all together in one place and celebrate, you know, safely. Libby Cohen, Reporting Texas TV.